Hello, my friends, and welcome back. Thank you very much for being with me again today. I think it was yesterday when I covered one article featuring my dear friend, German Foreign Minister Annalena Baerbock, infantile seventh grader. Uh, she had an interview with Fox News. And in that interview, she said that um, she labeled Xi Jinping, the president, the leader of China, as a dictator. And I said right then and there that China will talk to uh, the whatever uh, these guys have diplomatic mission in China. That's exactly what happened. Why? Because Miss Annalena Baerbock is infantile. Or maybe she was activated, maybe she had to say it. So I have this uh, article from Russia today and that tells us exactly that, that my baby doll, this one right here, she says something stupid and now Germany gets kicked in the, I was about to say balls, but Germany doesn't have balls since 1945. Since then is like squeak, squeak, squeak underneath there. Like Donald Trump grab her by the pussy. That's what Germany is yetzt. Or anyway, now. Uh, 18th of September 2023. China summons German envoy over Baerbock's dictator remark. Beijing has strongly criticized the German foreign minister for labeling President Xi a despot, calling her words open political provocation. What's up, baby doll? Well, it's weiß ich nicht. Shut the... Anyway. And that's what happened. It says that the ambassador was summoned to the Chinese foreign ministry on Sunday. A spokesman from the German Foreign Ministry told Agency France Press on Monday. Baerbock made her remark while on visit in New York on Thursday. Speaking to Fox News, she claimed that if West allowed Ukraine to lose its conflict with Russia, this would embolden, and I'm quoting the infantile, other dictators in the world like she, the Chinese president. All right. Anyway, Beijing was extremely dissatisfied with Baerbock's words, Chinese Foreign Minister spokeswoman Mao Ning told reporters earlier on Monday. Mao said that Baerbock's absurd comments violate, China, violate China's political dignity and are tantamount, is that how you call, pronounce it, to an open political provocation. It's not the first time, it's going to be the last one. Well, let's see uh, this uh, person closer, which lie right there. Well, I heard uh, miss uh, what's her name mao ning a few times i read her statement i think she is uh, uh much more prepared for any job that uh, this one would try okay so no surprises here the germans made another gaffe or maybe it was a uh, purposely made gaffe it doesn't really matter um china would not come back China is gone, got all the gold, the women and everything else. And you guys over there on the beach alone at the moonlight. So good job, uh, Annalena. You're doing a great, fantastic job. She's got some things, but definitely uh, is missing what she actually needs. Thank you very much for being with me again today. Stay strong, stay smart, look for the truth and be just.